Hello Libra and thank you so much for coming to your mid-April reading. Now we're just gonna hop into the reading right away. I didn't receive any clairaudience messages for you but I hope you guys are doing well and thank you guys so much for your support. It really helps me grow. I really, you know, I appreciate you Libras. <laughs> Alright, so this reading will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising. If nothing resonates, then, you know, just pick another reading. And if it does, just make sure you hit that like. Thank you. Alright, so Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising for mid-April. Alright, so we have the first card coming out is the Magician card, baby. So Libra, there is something you're creating, you're manifesting right now into your life. I see you being very creative wow um i see you working up some sort of plan um like writing out something so this could be a recipe this could be some sort of business plan i feel as though you're going to have some trouble sleeping as well because i feel like you're going to be thinking about whatever you're creating really like obsessively almost i don't yeah really obsessively because i feel like it's going to make you feel unbalanced and in stay unstable in a way and honestly don't think too much of this energy because we do have a tour um a stellium right now in taurus so we have we're feeling a lot of pressure right now in libra you are ruled by venus so it really i can feel you guys just actually feeling so a lot of things are coming down on you this could be you actually yeah like i said struggling to sleep and think overthinking something while you're sleeping this could be what somebody had previously said to you yeah so you i see you writing a business plan a recipe just writing out something i'm not too sure what <laughs> All right, so we have the page of cups as well. You could be actually writing a post on Instagram, a blog that you own, or Twitter as well. I feel as though you're communicating really lightheartedly with people, just, you know, back and forth, kikiing. Yeah, but I feel as though you're still kind of feeling anxious about something. So what's the Four of Swords? What's the Four of Swords for Libra? Feel, okay so i feel as though you feel anxious about something here because we have the knight of swords this is your energy feel as though you feel anxious about your personality so maybe you feel as though you can't be your full libra um libra like self right now feel as though you may feel as though everybody's judging you for who you are oh that's not nice that's not nice i felt that i felt that i felt that okay What's the magician card? I feel as though, yeah, you feel as though people are kind of judging you for who you are. So you may have Libra for, um, in the first house. So you the, maybe the thoughts that you have right now are of what somebody thinks of you currently. Maybe you're thinking what's keeping you up at night is somebody is how somebody feels about you so we have the six of pentacles here so you are manifesting something in regards to your work right now and it's definitely going to be something stable fruitful and definitely is going to re like reap a lot of abundance i feel as though you're mm, 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 mm. you see the six of pentacles here it also has the balance scales in the, the the card here so definitely your energy here libra i feel as though right now in money matters you things are feeling like it's looking up for you like you you are very confident in what you're able to bring in your life financially i feel as though it's just how you're it's certain limiting beliefs that you have and also worrying too much about what people have to say about you. That's really giving you anxiety here. Okay, so what's the page of page of cups? All right, so we have the five of cups in reverse. So I, I feel as though the page of cups is here. Okay, Libra, let's be real. I feel as though you may be focused too much on being on the internet, social media, or just on platforms in general because you're trying to avoid um, actually facing some sort of hurt or betrayal that you have felt recently. Yeah. I feel as though also you could be um, drinking quite a bit right now. 
I do see you drinking, maybe drinking to actually just distract yourself from something that you, you see on social media that puts you in this state of wondering what everybody thinks about you. All right, so we have the Three of Swords coming out in reverse here. So I feel as though you're you're trying you're trying to okay okay so you're trying to manifest healing into your life that's what i'm seeing you're trying to manifest healing but i feel as though there's too many swords here on this spread for me to actually say that you are manifesting healing because there needs to be this energy of water around you and the element uh, I mean the element of water around you and this energy of you like flowing within those waters of how you feel almost I feel so because you're too Libra you are very um, ethereal you you're very out there you're complex in the way you think you're not you're like of the ethers that's what you control almost and it's like I feel as though you're you're too in your head right now when you want something more emotional you want these emotional connections but i feel so you're too in your head about how to go about gaining these connections all right so what is the knight of swords now we're gonna shuffle again what is the knight of swords man i got into y'all right there all right, so we have the Knight of Rods and the Six of Cups. So I feel as though you're really um, in your head about somebody you were in, um, some that you've known for some for a long time now. Probably were in some sort of relationship for a long time. This could be a sibling, this could be a family member, or this could be just a really close best friend that you've known for some time now. I feel as though you are talking to this person, trying to get some sort of like advice from them almost. But I feel so you there's this energy of you still not completely hearing what they say yeah and with the knight of uh, wands right here i feel as though there's this energy of you you feeling very aggressive to the situation too Okay, I feel so Libra right now. You want to bring healing into life, but you're too busy thinking about the money. However, you take your your passionate masculine energy towards individuals who are more I feel as though you're taking more of your aggressive like masculine like energy towards the individuals who care about you and are very close to you. Not that you are being completely mean or or disruptive to these people. I feel as though there's this energy of you you needing to open up more, open up to those to those people in your life. Because I feel like everybody around you knows that you're very eloquent, you're adapt, and you're capable of achieving things. It's now what how relationships libra you're all about relationships it's like how much of my love compassion am i putting into my relationships dang libra dang how like this this is a work situation as well how much of my my love for my work am i putting into it nine of pentacles nine of pentacles libra you are able to be that business entrepreneur to be able to gain what you want and bring it into fruition. I feel as though you're in that cycle of always completing things. So you could be a very adapt worker. So you could have consistent amount of flow of money coming into you. But there's this energy of you not feeling fulfilled and it comes from the way you think about things. And the way you think about the individuals around you. Maybe you feel as though you can't trust some people around you right now, Libra. And I completely get... Okay, so we have the uh, the Knight of Rods in reverse. So that's the Knight of Wands. So this was the King of Wands. Yeah, so we have the Knight of Wands here in reverse. And I feel as though you could have been dealing with a fire sign who you feel as though turn their back on you and has completely changed 
you can't recognize this person. I don't know. I'm, those are the words I'm hearing, Libra. So take it how it applies. It feels though this individual has changed completely. And I don't know how you really feel. So I feel as though you have the Six of Swords right here. It's bringing you some sort of unease. It's making you feel abandoned at, um, for... It's making you feel abandoned. I don't know what I was trying to say there, man. All right, so with the Five of Cups here and the Six of Swords, I feel as though you are still missing this individual that isn't around you anymore. Truthfully, you are. But you're really in your head about the situation because I feel like you don't want to put your heart out there anymore. Understand, Libra, we have a lot of fixed earth energy around us right now astrologically speaking so anything water based anything that allows you not to go too deep like like a scorpio but not too mutable like a pisces in your emotions pick which one is worth for works for you but definitely allow yourself to tap into what you feel because the energies around us right now are so fixed and it's it's telling us oh don't move you know it's really like kind of restricting in a way and it's making us feel very uneasy i get that but i feel as though allowing yourself to at least like do something water-based is going to help you so this is going for doing baths spiritual baths this is you um taking a swim if you have a pool or something i don't know um just putting your feet in some water giving yourself a pedicure getting a pedicure T taking care of you you know all right so we have the ten of pentacles yeah so you probably were in some sort of marriage relationship with this person and you guys are no longer in this relationship because you feel as though this person is completely different from what you knew them to be and that is really what's throwing you off kind of right now libra because this person i feel so kind of emotionally manipulated you in a ways too or this is how you feel or emotionally manipulated you to get close to your money now we have the high priestess so i feel as though there are some secrets you're actually holding on to and there's secret things that you do know that you actually are keeping secret about this individual just to save face or save peace and i feel as though you're kind of feeling at your wits end and that's what's making you feel up in your head definitely towards the end of april and unable to sleep here okay this is making sense all right so we have the ace of pentacles in reverse and then we have the nine of nine of cups sorry so libra you have been wishing for something i don't know if you've been wishing for somebody to have issues in some sort of money situation or and I feel as though a wish you have made or are being that's being bestowed upon you by the divine is is at a result being kind of taken. I don't want to say taken because it was this is yours, but taken away from somebody else. All right, and that's due to the fact that this individual was not proper was too focused was too focused on other areas in their business. So I don't know what this means. So this could be a co-worker that you are working with who is not focused on the job at hand and the task and you actually end up getting the promotion, take it how it applies. Or this could be actually an ex-partner that you have whose money is not doing so well in their business because they have never actually been focused on their business at all. But this is actually bringing you some sort of, um, I'm going to say smug, smug energy to you. So I don't know how you're, you're going to take this Libra, but if this, if you feel like this is justice for you, then let it be justice for you. But if you feel as though this is happening to you, then yeah, apply it to how your story seems fit. But thank you so much Libra. Bye.